A New Mexico mother living a relatively normal life until just a year ago. As of this week, no one has heard from or seen Alicia B. Hill. As News 13's Brittany Bade shows you, she did leave behind one cryptic clue. There are dozens of billboards in Cibola County. But to Alicia V. Hill's sister. How? It's been how? The not, the not knowing has been how? And father. I just miss her a lot. There is only one that matters. We thought that might be a good way to generate some, you know, some help. Roberta V. Hill and her family are using their own resources to put up billboards to find their missing loved one. Last August, Alicia V. Hill simply disappeared. It was odd that she just vanished. Cibola County Sheriff Tony Mace says he doesn't believe this is a case of foul play. She just um, up and left everything, her cell phone, her car keys, um, and then we found a note on a desk that she had wrote. May says this is not a suicide note, but it does appear to say goodbye. I'm not crazy. I know what I'm doing. I just miss Andrea. Andrea, V. Hill's eldest daughter, died from a lifelong illness last year, devastating her. I don't think you can never get over that. I don't, I think it's the ju just a different way of dealing with your life. Roberta thought her younger sister was getting better. Even starting to renovate her San Rafael home, but then she suddenly disappeared. We're all missing her. We all, we all hope that she's doing okay. Alicia's family knows she may have run away, but worry something may have happened to her. I don't think that you just leave your life and leave your family hanging. So for now, they'll keep putting up billboards and keep hoping she'll come home. Somebody out there knows something. Brittany Bade, KRQE News 13. Alicia V. Hill's youngest daughter is getting married in two months and would like her mother to be there. If you have information about where she might be, we have two contact numbers on our website. Just go to krqe.com.